But Henry Salgado of Belmore says he'll vote for Trump's rival, Texas Senator Ted Cruz. I'm a Republican, but I think uh, Ted has more to give us than, than Trump. It's totally, completely wrong what he's saying. about immigration and the economy. News 12 Long Island's Rich Barabi begins our team coverage now from Beth Page. Rich? Donald Trump delivered the red meat that this audience of thousands was craving to hear tonight, a Long Island flavor. I love these people. These are my people. Donald Trump may be a Manhattan resident and a Queens native, but tonight's campaign rally... ...tests until a few tense moments. Nassau County police moved in quickly as some Trump protesters and supporters began arguing. So what do these Long Islanders think now that they've had the chance to hear Trump speak in person? I like it. He's, he's strong, and I think he's going to win the Trump country back. It was a beautiful rally, and people will leave here with a very positive message to make America great again. That's the message. My mom's from Mexico, and everyone is surprised when I say that I really like him because they're like, you're Mexican, you should hate him because of the whole border idea. But everything he says makes sense. But Henry Salgado of Belmore says he'll vote for Trump's rival, Texas Senator Ted Cruz. I'm a Republican, but I think uh, Ted has more to give us than, than Trump. It's totally, completely wrong what he's saying. Trump spoke for about 45 minutes. His speech was only interrupted once by a protester.